Well, hello. Welcome to uh, the Revved Up Biker channel. Uh, I've been off my bike for a couple of weeks um, for charging issues on my bike. Um, I had a flat battery just before Christmas and um, I thought, right, okay, the battery's had it, so I'll change the battery and um, put it on and um, within a short time it had completely gone flat again. So uh, I knew it couldn't be the battery because it's a brand new battery. It has to be something to do with the charging system. So I took all the bike apart, had a look at the uh, power output from the stator and uh, on the tick over it's pumping out about 40, 45 volts and uh, up to about 70 volts when I hit about 5,000 revs. And um, that's okay. I uh, did a diode test on the regulator rectifier and that all seemed okay. And uh, plugging everything up, and I've done a kind of like mod on the wiring where I've actually directly uh, connected the regulator rectifier straight up onto the battery. And um, at the moment I'm pumping out Let me have a look here. Right, hang on a sec. I'm pumping out about 14.7 volts. I've got one of these little uh, voltmeters. I'm going to have to pull it out because it keeps taking the power. And um, yeah, it's all okay when it's cold. As soon as it gets hot and the. Um, let me get a bit closer. As soon as it gets cold. It uh, decides to um, cut the fan in, and that the uh, power drops to about 13.5 volts, which you know, okay, is acceptable. But um, <coughs> then, as soon as you turn the bike off and switch it back on again, the only power that you're getting out of the regulator rectifier is about 12 and a half volts, which is not enough for some strange odd reason. You let the bike cool down and then all of a sudden you're back up to 14 and a half volts again, which is incredibly strange. I've been on a few forums and they've said to me that um, it's possibly the regulator rectifier that's at fault, the actual regulator part, but I think I've just got a NAF regulator rectifier. So I've kind of like loosely wired it up at the moment onto the current regulator rectifier but I need to probably go get another one and get it working and hopefully be a little bit happier. Right, let's get paid. Right, number nine please. Yep. Brilliant, thank you very much, cheers. back up to 14.6 volts 14.5 14.6 I say it's doing its job at the moment which is what we should be seeing about uh, 14 and a half volts. There, now it's showing 12.7. As soon as the bike seems to get warm, you switch it off and then switch it back on again. It then drops 12.4. So that's not charging. 
So I'm now probably eating away at the battery. Just filled up and you can see that my uh, petrol light's still on. I think I haven't got something uh, plugged up. We're at 12.3 now. We're in the dangerous territory. 12. Switch back off and then it goes up slightly, slightly bit more. So I think it is definitely the regulator rectifier. Let's take you out. So guys, um, I'm probably not going to be vlogging too much for a couple of weeks until I actually get this finally sorted and I think I um, have to get myself another regulator rectifier and get this finally hit on the head because um, last year I was um, doing a ride to um, Cambridge um, for like um, the American uh, uh, cemetery that's up there and um, Bex 88 was on the ride as well and she actually went past me and saw me in a lay-by pulled over and uh, broken down because the battery conked out, died out of power, the whole bike just went dead and uh, that was with a brand new stator, brand new regulator rectifier but still it's doing this problem of not uh, sending the charge to the to the battery properly properly and uh, having this intermittent problem. So uh, I'm going to need to get something that's got a lot more beef in it, that's uh, not so cheap and cheerful. <coughs> Getting back on the bike. 12.4. See what happens when I start it back up again. Fourteen point six. Fourteen point four, fourteen point five. About fourteen and a half. But um, I ain't gonna ride it but, uh, much more with this. Oh come on lady. Seriously, seriously need to get this sorted. It's even half thinking of uh, doing a ride down to Barcelona this year. But uh, if the battery and the charging system's not going to hold out, then there's no point of that. 